Community Arts Council and Blue Ridge Art Space to a wonderful new project. You know, the high country is so richly blessed with artists of all descriptions, from the many musicians of all genres to visual artists, varying from fine arts to craftsmen, to a varied and talented array of local authors who are creating everything from poetry to novels and documentaries, and some even write screenplays. Like everybody else, though, the artists in the high country are struggling since the COVID-19 has literally shut us all down. Artists who relied upon revenue from gigs or sales of artwork and so forth are suddenly finding themselves at a standstill. Artists don't qualify for uh, traditional unemployment, and so unless they have some other resource for paying their bills and putting food on the table, then they're in dire need. Recently, Lucas Truba, who's a local musician, contacted the Watauga County Arts Council with the idea of creating a benefit virtual concert series aimed at not only helping musicians, but artists of all disciplines. And from this idea emerged the concept of Blue Ridge Art Stream, a weekly virtual event showcasing the various talents of our many local artists. And while we're sharing their talents, you're invited to share back by donating to help local artists who are struggling. Each artist is going to be putting up their own Venmo link, so you can elect to donate directly to that artist, or you might choose to donate directly to the designated fund to support local artists who apply through the Watauga County Arts Council. So I'd like to introduce the man with the brains behind this idea, Lucas, Lucas Treba to you, the guy that thought of this whole thing. He's going to be our very first performer in what I hope is going to be an ongoing series. Welcome, Lucas. Hey, Jerry. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm excellent. This has been a really, process. It has Since been. Since the it's time been. you contacted me until now has been a process. <laughs> it has been. I think it's been like a month and a half of just solid work. It really has. And we have drawn together. Let's let's give credit credit where it's due. We have drawn together a great team of folks. You and I originally talked. And yes. then I brought in my uh, former intern, Amanda Mason. And she has been terrific in organizing and keeping things together. And I brought in our board president, Ginger Bryant, who has added a lot to this whole process. And then tell us about who you brought into the process. We also brought in Wes Waugh, who is a visual mm -hmm. artist, uh, very uh, popular in the community. He makes some stunning work. Right. We also brought in Alora Dash, who is like a media marketing wizard. She's one of my really good friends. And yes. We had a few mm -hmm. bands together. Uh, we also brought in uh, Fulton Lovin. Um, who is a business owner, local business owner. He owns the Horton Hotel. Um, so he's been a big help kind of just giving us that business side of things. And then we brought in one more person, right? Patrick. No, I think that's it. Oh, oh, yes, Patrick Richardson from the Arts Council, who is in the, uh, from the Arts Council standpoint, someone to kind of vet to make sure this stays family friendly. And that's Patrick's role. So uh, all that team has been meeting folks on a very regular basis to uh, make this thing happen. And this is our premiere, our first try. We've been working out a whole lot of technical kinks, but I'm praying and hoping that we've got all the little bugs out of the system and it's going to work well tonight. So uh, Lucas is going to be the one who, who gives us the first shot, the guinea pig, to make it all happen. So Lucas, you're a musician. It worked out very nicely that you were able to do this. So you've got a performance plan for tonight. And I'm going to let you take that away, and good luck tonight. Excellent. Thank you, Cherry. All right. Well, yeah. Thanks, you guys. I'm excited to get this whole thing started. Um, let's see. I got a few songs from my first album. You can find it on SoundCloud. Uh, just search my name, Lucas Treva. Um, should pop right up. Um, and then a few that aren't on the album. This first one's called The Fisher. That's not on the album.
So, <laughs> thanks you guys. Um, so I'm a singer songwriter uh, from Clayton, North Carolina, but I've lived in Boone for about five years. Uh, I moved up here to study classical guitar um, at App State, um, and I just I loved it so much. I've written a lot of music up here, been in a lot of bands. Um, feel free to check some of them out: um, uh, Speedball and Depot Street. Um, uh, most of the stuff I play is like rock and roll, blues, reggae, funk, punk kind of influence. Um, I guess you could say alternative, um, and then some classical guitar influence there as well. I usually play with my fingernails, but I just played that really thick. Um, I'm going to play you guys another song. This is actually the, um, um, the title track for, uh, for the album. It's called Being Human. Yeah. 
Just your bags at the door. No one knows what you came for. Been once before. I know exactly what you're made of. You love me like a palm love. Till she was a jealous attitude. Miscuous to kiss me like a deadly serpent in the sleep. Angels play while I held on so tightly, my fingers start to bleed. And I hope that you win out smiling. Oh, just like a chariot blazing in the dirt before his Comes home from work I'm gonna start team to scratch the surface of work. It's like being a, or just being human. Just being human. Just being human. Oh.
Yeah. Thanks, you guys. <clears throat> um, it's kind of weird. Uh, I haven't played a show. This is like the first show I played, except uh, uh, for the rooftop at the Horton Hotel. I played that with uh, Fulton Lovin and uh, Wes Wall. They were there. Um, this is uh, other than that. This is the first gig that I played in over a month and a half. Probably about two. Maybe, well, maybe almost two months now. Um, it's been quite a while, so um, I'm excited just to just to be able to play with you people and uh, to get something like this going. We've had so much help, so um, my heart goes out to everybody who's put in countless hours sitting by a computer and talking to talking to a bunch of us bunch of us folks so uh it, it's been a great experience so um uh, i got a couple more songs for you guys um this one's called uh, humble dragon <laughs> Traveling around the stony road, I wear my mind on my shoulders and my heart on my sleeve. So we know. Where I'm from, nobody knows, but it's okay because I'm already gone. If that's okay, please forgive me. Humility corrects me if I'm wrong. Humility, please show me how we so wrong. Humility corrects me if I'm wrong. Humility, please show me how we so wrong. Temptation couldn't buy me. I wear my mind on my shoulders and my heart on my sleeve slowly. Where I'm from, nobody cares. And everywhere I go, I get a thousand stares. If that's okay, please forget me. Wasting in this dirty town, dirty town, time I low out to pitch at a lonely sound. Empty cans and little chats, baby, I'm leaving here and I ain't coming back. If that's okay, you can have me. If that's okay, you can have me. Humility, correct me if I'm wrong. Humility, please show me where I'm in. It's 
for a late night uh, talk show host because they, they have no audience now. It's terrible for them. Um, I got two more for you unless uh, somebody cuts in and says I'm over time. Um, trying to keep things short and sweet. Uh, this next one's called Epitaph. So then My father said be afraid of love, I'll tell you one story about he 
hours. Drunk but a working man, work to the bone tonight. Three on me, kids think I'm on my way home. The rain struck my windshield, my optics were flooded. I chose to make Cambridge my last place on earth. Sped for the barricade, hollow man, struck a but what really kills me is how they were My alley sleeps in a car nice and soft in her dreams exist on the same plane as my flood. She dreams of a giant huge yellow big sponge to soak up all the pain for which she was born. And I slammed on my senses, I came to my brakes as my tires ripped pavement and tore through concrete. I just started wishing I was at that lead, just a kissing her cheek while she solemnly sleeps. Bless your father is a liar, a cheat, and he's doomed to repeat all this hypocrisy. Need you right now, need you so bad, but I can't even expect you to be here. Off of his feet and poor Allie met dad as she left her car seat and tossed around bottles and half eaten mugs. Allie thought long before a papers My father said be a brave girl, I'll tell you a story about who I am. A drunk, not a worthless man, worth every bone tonight. All of my kids know me, I'm coming home. Mm. Almost made me cry a few times. That's good. That's a good sign. Well, thank you guys. I appreciate it so much. Um, thank you for supporting uh, not just me, but all your local artists and, and uh, you know all the visual artists, uh, poets, uh, dancers, musicians, all of that stuff, writers. Um, uh, you're supporting everybody out there by donating. Um, so there's a way to donate to uh, Blue Ridge Art Stream as a whole. Um, I think uh, there's going to be a link provided for that. Um, and also, you can uh, donate to me directly um, with my Venmo. Um, it's just uh, at Lucas-Treba, like a hyphen. So that's uh, Lucas-Treba. L-U-C-A-S-T-R-I-B-A. If you guys want to donate to me directly, um, any donations will be met with many thanks and 
probably a, a heart on the uh, on the light thing. So um, <laughs> check out my other bands, um, Speedball and Depot Street. Uh, Depot Street. We were in the process of recording an album before uh, this all uh, before COVID hit. Um, but Speedball, we just uh, recorded two songs, um, a short EP, and that'll be released on May 20th. Um, follow us on Instagram for more in- information about that at Speedball Band. Um, so that'll be in a week and a half. Um, so look out for that. That'll be awesome. Or two weeks or so. Um, so yeah, uh, next week we have uh, Jake Hodges, uh, who's going to be on the uh, on the marquee. So uh, tune in next week, 7 p.m., same day, same time. And check out Jake Hodges, really good friend of mine, great musician. Um, and that's pretty much it. So uh, I love you guys. Stay safe. Take care of each other. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Cherry? Hi there. That was wonderful, Lucas. Thank you. Great idea and great music. Can't do any better. <laughs> And a great guy to work with. Y'all need need to get to know him. He's really worth it. Now, folks, I do want to remind you of a couple of things. One, we are planning on continuing the series. We plan to feature a collage of artists, whether it's listening to musicians, sharing their own tunes, or watching painters create paintings from a blank canvas in front of your eyes, or maybe listening to an author's poetry, transporting you to another place in time. So as our concert series grows, every Saturday at 7 p.m., tune in to the Blue Ridge Art Space, Watauga County Arts Council Facebook page and sit back and enjoy the local talent that lives right here in the Blue Ridge Mountains of Western North Carolina. The contract content will be rich and varied and family friendly. And so settle in with the whole family to enjoy some of what makes living here so special. And also, I do want to remind you, just like Lucas did, that the motivation behind this whole concert series was to provide a resource for artists that are struggling here in the high country. So you can make a donation directly to the artist, just like this time it was Lucas, through their own Venmo account. And you can also give to the Artist Relief Fund by clicking on the links. And that fund is being managed by the Target County Arts Council. And all the money that's raised in that fund is going to go to artists who apply for assistance and relief. So now please take a minute, mark your calendar, set a reminder, set your alarm clock, whatever it takes. Join us this and every Saturday evening at 7 p.m. as we present the amazing talent of our artist friends and neighbors. And we'll see you next week. Goodbye.